travelers welcome back to my channel jade here with lux travel we are a boutique luxury travel agency curating door-to-door -door itineraries for our clients to experience the best each destination has to offer um, we partner with the best properties resorts cruise ships experiences in each destination and they will vip and take great care of our clients um, for the instructions on how to book with me, just send me an email via my email address linked down below and we'll take it from there. Um, if this is um, your first time here and you enjoy this type of hotel reviews and um, stay feedback in luxury properties, click that subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be alerted for our weekly new uploads. I have um, been to this region of Turkish uh, Riviera a few times and I have stayed and visited the best properties in this region. I will just start off by saying this is hands down my favorite properties in the Turkish Riviera. Um, Dimaris Bay is located in Marmaris. Um, it's <coughs> The closest airport has limited flights which is about one hour and a half away and there's um, another airport boardroom which we usually fly into due to more frequent fly routes from uh, Istanbul that you know has service multiple flights a day uh, that is two hours away by driving we hire a taxi from the airport and just um just um to let you know that the road is not an easy one if you're sitting um you know if you're not driving as of course we are hiring taxi we were just sitting in a taxi um it's tons of mountain roads up in elevation down in ele elevation the pressure in your ear constantly changes so um, that's definitely something to take into consideration the best way to reach here would be a helicopter ride as there is a helipad um, located just in this property um Dimaris bay is absolutely stunning property uh, there are five private beaches for the guests to enjoy each of them featuring glistening clear uh, water and um, beautiful in amenity set up um, has bar and restaurants to service the guests uh, there is one main pool which is hardly used by guests because most people including us prefer to be by the beach side and there is a massive uh, indoor jacuzzi area in the spa um, the property is operating on bed and breakfast basis it is truly a very uh, nice luxury property the breakfast has a huge spread um, offering all kinds of cuisines and I would say service is um, pretty good not amazing for including the um, to take into consider uh, to take into consideration the food and beverage outlets they're not so um, you know they are not so great in terms of service there are some times that we just have to actually most of the times we kind of have to go and order our stuff by where the waiters are standing um, however this will not take away your overall experience at Dimar Bay because this is just such a stunning property and the staff um, the service from the staff um, in the hotel area certainly makes up for that the best service for um, the food and beverage outlet we had was definitely at the Zuma restaurant um, the hotel has a funicula has a ferry transfers to drop you off to different beaches there is uh, one beach for everyone to enjoy it's really extended um, in the beach sandy area as well as um, the dock over water where um, underneath a beautiful rock cliff um, 
then there are um, one beach for adults only it's the silent beach as well as one beach for um, suite guests so that's an ad additional perk when you book a suite over here you get an extra beach to enjoy there is one beach outside of Manos the Greek Taverna um, I feel like this beach has um, maybe the minimum service um, I think most of the stuff you're just kind of like grab and get for yourself however it is so stunning the color scheme and everything and just the feeling of being um, you know something familiar if you have been to Greece now that you are across the bay you're super close to Greece actually just 20 minutes speedable ride you're at Sima the closest uh, uh, Greek island from Mamaris and um, you know the feeling of being the familiar thing feeling of being in Greek taverna and um, at night there's performances dances so it's a big hangout spots and then there's the Grite, which is a um, beach club um, that's featuring um, well I guess I am not sure what type of cuisine they are focused on but it's um, like a really um, nicely set up beach club I love all the decor so it's kind of you know, um, distressed, uh, minimum, like French Riviera type of style. However, um, as mentioned, food and beverage service over here in terms of service is also not great. The food has always been good when we order. It's just that you kind of have to get up and do that service like yourself, which is somewhat expected if you are, um, you know, a, a frequent traveler of certain regions in around Mediterranean um, there's just massive grounds to be covered there's a different green hill for sunset point I mean our stay was absolutely amazing and I really would already kind of plan to come back for our future family vacation. I don't know exactly when yet, but it's definitely a place that we would love to return. So for increase on this property and to get VIP benefits when you book with me as my client, send me an email via my email address linked down below and we'll take it from there. Enjoy the rest of the video. See you in the next one.